Here are the kids. This is the future of America, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, every so often, we like to invite a, a few uh, bright young students to demonstrate for us the latest scientific principles that they have learned. It's something we call kid scientists. And here they are. Hello, kids. Thank you so very much for uh, being here, kids. Uh, first time in New York for everybody? Mm -hmm. No, nope, I've been here before. before. Everybody been here before? <laughs> All right, let's get right to the uh, scientific activities. <laughs> and you, uh, my dear, uh, Kareem Nam, am I pronouncing your name properly? Yes. All right, Kareem, nice to see you. How old are you? 12 years old. 12 years old, and uh, are you in school? Yeah. Yeah. Where we're, we're already having fun, aren't we? <laughs> ah. uh, where do you go to school? I Green. go to Kennedy Junior High School. Mm -hmm. And I see that you're the, it's the home of the, some kind of hawk. It looks like a ferocious bird there. Kennedy, eagles, eagles. <laughs> if, I, if I had just finished reading the shirt. <laughs> All right, uh, Kareem, now you're going to be demonstrating something here that is very puzzling. It's audio salt. Yeah. Audio salt. All right, Kareem, take it away. Here we go. Okay, so first we're going to make this metal plate vibrate mm -hmm. with this audio wave driver. Okay. And this will create sounds of various frequencies, and this will also set up two-dimensional wave patterns. Mm. And this, we're going to pour some salt onto this metal plate. Okay. And the salt that you will see is going to vibrate, except where there are nodal lines. Oh, is, is, except where there are nodal lines? Yeah, okay. nodal lines. So, so we're actually now seeing a sound waves uh, visualized via the salt, is that correct? Yes. Okay. Now, may I touch it? Yes. Are you sure? Yes. Ah! Oh! Ah! <laughs> okay, easy. All right, knock it off. <laughs> you, you, you can use that one back at school. All right, let's go, uh, Kareem. You need some help there, Kareem? No, I okay. think it's fine. It's fascinating because their physics uh, apply in every aspect of natural existence, don't they? They're, it's just everywhere, right? <laughs> yeah. So I'm going, go. I'm going to turn it on, okay. and then when it starts to go, I'm going to ask you to put some more salt on oh, sure. as we go yeah. along. Yeah. Whoa, look at that. Those are the, the nodule uh, lines. The place where the salts do not uh -huh. move is the places where the nodal lines. Nodal lines, And yeah. that's where the waves cancel each other out. Okay, can I get in here with yeah. a little more? Whoa. Dump a little more on? Yes. Have you ever tried it with fresh ground pepper? <laughs> no. Whoa. Oh my goodness, look at that. That's beautiful. Okay. Kareem Nam, everyone. Beautiful job. Thank you very much. Wow. That was cool. That was very cool, wasn't it? You are uh, Georgia Sturtz. Mm -hmm. Hi, Georgia. How are you? Good. And you go to Lincoln uh, Junior High School. You're in the eighth grade, uh, 14 years old, and that's home of the Lincoln Lancers. Yeah. yeah. Uh, eighth grade. So you get ready to go to high school? Oh, yeah. Are you excited about that? Definitely. Uh -huh. uh, and uh, where will you go to high school? Um, Naperville Central High School. That's very good. I hear nothing but good things about it. <laughs> and uh, a lot of your friends going with you to high school? All of them. All of them. That's nice. <laughs> And you'll be soon looking forward to maybe starting to drive a little bit, huh? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Excited <laughs> about that? Brothers and sisters? One older brother and one older sister. Uh huh. And they're good? Everything's happy? Yeah. <laughs> do, do your folks have a favorite of the three? <laughs> and, and I got to tell you, your, your teeth already look terrific. And when those, when those things come off, they're going to be so beautiful, you won't believe it. Thank you. My, uh, I was supposed to have braces when I was a kid, but I, my, I didn't. My uh, uh, parents uh, used the money for a, a wet bar downstairs. <laughs> so, uh, 
Now, this looks fascinating. We're going to see... Uh, <laughs> we're going to see a stream of light. A stream of light. All right, take it away. Whatever you need here, Georgia. Okay. Well, here we have a pop bottle filled with water right. and some molecules of dye. Mm -hmm. Now, there's a hole on one end of the bottle, but don't worry, no water's going to come out right. because the cap is screwed on tight. Now, I'm going to take this laser pointer and I'm going to point it through this side of the bottle so that it comes out the other end. Okay. Now, now, we shouldn't look at the laser pointer? No. Okay, don't look at the laser pointer. You, well, you can, you can look at it, but not the, we just can't shine it directly into your eyes. Well, yeah, that's right. Yeah, okay. All right, I'm going to need... <laughs> All right, I can see it on the monitor. Whoa, wow. <laughs> Wow, that's exciting. That, that's uh, uh, rebounding off the molecules of color, is that correct, Georgia? Yeah, mm -hmm. that's yeah. called the Tyndall effect, where you can, it's bouncing off the particles of the dye. Wow. Yep. So now I'm going to loosen this cap okay. so that some a stream of oh. water comes out. <laughs> that's, the, the scary part's over. Oh, okay. well, that's what you think. <laughs> Okay, what do we do here? Hold on, we're gonna get this bucket first because okay. water's coming out. Can I unscrew that for you? Um, sure, but first we're gonna take the tape off. Oh, okay. Because otherwise... Oh, oh there's the hole in the thing. There's That's the hole. That's what you were talking about. Mm -hmm. All right, now uns unscrew it just a little bit. A little bit? Just to release a little pressure? Mm -hmm. Whoa, wow. You can see the stream of light. The, you can actually see it bouncing. If you want to, you can put your hand underneath it and see the it actually on your hand where the light's coming. Ah! That's great. Comes right down there, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. Now, right. the light is hitting the water to air boundary, and it's at an angle of reflection that is greater than the critical angle, which causes it to be internally reflected. Now, if the stream of water is not too steep, then it, it hits it at the air interface, which causes it to be totally reflected. But as you see, the water level is going down. Mm -hmm. Now, if the water gets too steep because there's not enough water, this rule will be violated and you will see the light on the wall because it's just oh, shining right through. That's right. No, no water for it to uh, reflect into or beyond. Exactly. It'll just straight go right. straight as through. As though there were no water because there won't be water. <laughs> that's fascinating. <laughs> okay. Very nice. Thank you very much, Georgia. Georgia Sturt. I'm sorry, my hands are wet. Beautiful job. <laughs> Nick Radmer. Hi, Nick. How are you, buddy? Welcome uh, to the program. Good to have you with us. Me too. Uh, okay. You're uh, uh, seventh grade Lincoln Junior High, and the, the Lincoln we know those are the uh, Lancers. Is that right? Go to her school. Yeah, you yeah. guys go to school together. So mm -hmm. your classmates, you know one another? Sort of. Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> Um, what are you going to do for us here, Nick? Well, I'm going to show you how to, um, an example of volume expanding in a balloon here. Volume right. expanding in a balloon. Yeah. Yeah, you ought to see my Aunt Hazel. <laughs> All right. Well, if you want to come over here. Yes, I do. Uh, Nick, I do want to come over here. Okay. Well, Excuse uh, me, ladies. Well, Dave, when a liquid changes from a liquid to a gas, there's a very large volume increase. Mm. So we're going to demonstrate this by you pouring liquid nitrogen into this funnel here. Okay. But don't do it yet. Don't do no, it. Don't do it yet. No, no, not no. The signal. Now, no. after you're going, after you pour the liquid nitrogen into the funnel, you're going to take this cap and you're going to screw it on really tight. Mm -hmm. But then so do you screw it on in the, to the bottom part of the funnel, or where do I screw it on? Yeah, um, you just uh, you'll take the funnel out. Oh, take the funnel. Oh, I see. Okay. All right. Yeah. But um, and then you might want to take these gloves. Okay. Right here. <laughs> okay. So, um, and then once you've poured, and uh, you also might want to take these goggles. <laughs> you can take these. Okay, what about your buddies? Do they need the goggles too? Uh, no, they can just stand by, stand back. <laughs> okay, all right. Okay. Okay, so now you can pour. Do I uncork now, this? Yeah, go ahead and pour it in. I uncork that? Uh, yeah, uncork that. Okay. All right, now just pour that uh, bottle into the funnel. All right. 
the, the entire contents? Uh, I think so. Well, just as much as it can. <laughs> The whole thing? I guess, yeah. yeah. You guess? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that should... That's enough there? No. A little more? A little bit more, yeah. A little more? <laughs> yeah, you're supposed to put your goggles on. Get them on. <laughs> Tell me when to stop here. Uh, about now. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh. All right, it, now, it, you know, it, it dripped. I felt it dripped. Take, take the funnel, take the funnel out, out and cap it up. Yeah, now put the cap on. Okay. And screw it on really, really tight, okay? All right. There we go. All right. Now, you're gonna... Look out. Oh. Put on these ear protectors. Oh, oh my God, put these on. What, yeah. what about you? Just what about put them on. Oh, get back. back up. Everybody, get back. Get back. Get down. Where are you? Get over here. Get down. Get over there. You might want to... Get, get down. Get down. This might take a while. What? This might take a while. Well, we're running out of tape. Well, if you want, you can take... There's a needle up there. You can I poke can't, it. I have these things on. You can take them off for a second. That doesn't help me here when you do this. You can take the needle over there and poke it. There's oh, a okay. needle on the table. Right here. All right. Poke it. Poke it. Wow. Okay. Man, that was that was something, wasn't it? Yeah. <laughs> Is it safe to bring the audience back in? <laughs> Nick, thank you very much. Graham, thank you very much. Thank you. Georgia, thank you very much. There's your kid scientist, everybody.